Today is Pancake Day, so Peppa and her family are meeting at a fancy pancake restaurant. Hello, I'll be your chef today. I make the pancakes right at your table and you get to help. What kind of pancakes can we make? Any you can think of. We have lots of yummy ingredients. I'll have the special mushroom pancake, please. One banana-licious banana pancake with extra bananas for me, please. Coming right up. Miss Rabbit is good at making pancakes. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Now a little colour. Then add the mushrooms. Bananas and extra bananas. Ooh! And now for the best bit. Smelling. Eating. <laughs> Flipping it. Exactly. Woohoo! Miss Rabbit is very good at making pancakes. <laughs> Yay! Mmm! Phew! Now, what would you two like in your pancakes? I would like a chocolatey chocolate pancake. With chocolate, please! <laughs> you clearly have a sweet tooth. And you, George? <laughs> oh! Peas and tomato for George. And pineapple, coconut, Cabbage. Hmm. And this. No, that's oh. red hot chilli. Peppa. <laughs> Peppa and George like all kinds of ingredients on their pancakes and lots of them. Ta-da! Yay! Want to help me flip? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> now, on the count of three, we'll give them a gentle little flip. One, two, flip! <laughs> Peppa and George have flipped their pancakes Whoa. very high and onto <laughs> Mr. Bull's plate. Oh, yummy! Mmm, tar very much. Mmm, it's sweet mm. and savoury, crunchy and oh, spicy. Oh, Ooh, delicious! Oh. <laughs> It's a special surprise pancake. Oh, mm. pancake? <laughs> Peppa and George love making super special surprise pancakes. Looks like we'll have to make another for you two. Yay! Yay! <laughs> but they really love eating them when they're done. Today is Pancake Day at Peppa's Playgroup. Ah! Whoa! It's an ice cream! Can we make other pancake pictures? Yes, we can! We just need more pancake mix. Yay! <laughs> Peppa pours flour into the bowl. <laughs> Candy Cat adds an egg to the mix. Danny Dog adds the milk. And Susie Sheep gives everything a good mix. <laughs> Madam Gazelle adds food colouring to the pancake mix so they can make colourful pancake pictures. Now we can draw any pancake picture we like in the cold pan before we cook the pancake. Can you add some pink here, Susie? <laughs> and some more over here? Wow! What is it? Uh -huh. hmm. <laughs> what are you drawing, Madam Gazelle? You'll see. Now the pan will get very hot. So you must step back for this bit, children. The pancake looks just like Pepper. I'm Pepper Pancake. 
<laughs> and I'm really yummy. Can we make a rainbow next? Why, of course. Peppa and her friends add all the colours of the rainbow. Red. Orange. Yellow. Green. Blue. Cake. <laughs> no, you haven't. All the blue has created a lovely blue sky. Come Let's make the biggest pancake in the world. Hooray! Baking powder will give us the fluffiest pancake. Just a little will do. Madam Gazelle has added more than a little baking powder. The pancake is getting bigger and bigger. Oh dear. I'm not sure we can eat this, children. Aww. But it makes a great trampoline. Peppa loves Pancake Day. Everyone loves Pancake Day. <laughs> Yummy, tasty food. Yummy, tasty food. Today on the cruise, yum, Peppa yum. and her family are at a very Special type of restaurant. This is a special type of restaurant called a buffet. Just take a plate and choose the food you want to eat. Enjoy! Oh, oh goody! The restaurant mm. buffet has lots of different foods to choose from. What would you like to eat, Peppa? Spaghetti is my favourite. Right you are. But we mustn't take too much. We can always come back and get some more. Oh, good idea. <laughs> and what would you like, George? Juice! Thirsty, are you? I think we can rustle up some orange <laughs> juice. Let's see here. Aha! The orange juice machine is very loud. And it hasn't made very much orange juice at all. Oh. Juice! We'll just have to make some more. <laughs> Delicious! I can't wait to... Finished! Oh. Mm. <laughs> you were hungry, Pepper. Can I get some more now, please? Oh. Of course. Let's go. Hooray! Grandpa Pig is still trying to make George a cup of orange juice. Oh, dear. Could we have some more oranges, please, Miss Rabbit? Right away. Ooh. Peppa has found a very special pancake machine. Just one pancake, please, Mr. Robot. I can always come back and get more. Mm -hmm. Splendid! Aha! Granny Pig is ah. very excited to eat her spaghetti. Ah! Finished! Oh. Thank you, Pancake Robot. But now, Peppa is thirsty mm. too. Can I get some juice as well, Granny? Of course. Grandpa Pig can get you some. I do wonder what's ah. taking him so long. Mm. <gasps> Grandpa Pig has finally made a cup of orange juice. In fact, Grandpa Pig has made lots of cups of orange juice. Oh. The machine has finally stopped oh. making orange juice. Phew. Silly Grandpa. You don't need to make all the juice. You can always come back and get more. Peppa loves the buffet restaurant. Mm. And George really <laughs> loves orange juice. Welcome oh. to the ice cream shop. It is a very hot day. So Peppa and George are playing ice cream shop. Here you go, Mr. Daddy Pig. Oh, thank you. What would you like, Mrs. Mummy Pig? I'd like a banana split, please. Hooray! Oh. Ooh! What's a banana split, Granny? 
it's a type of dessert. First, we need to cut a banana in half. Nana! Oh! Ho, 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 ho! Now, we add ice cream, cherries and whipped cream. Oh. George oh. likes adding the ice cream. Careful! Don't squish the oh. banana. <laughs> And Pepper really likes adding whipped cream. <laughs> Don't forget the cherry on top. Here is your banana split, Mrs. Mummy Pig. <laughs> this looks delicious. Oh, please could I have... A knickerbocker glory. Uh -huh. A knockanori? What's that, madam? Ho, ho, ho. Uh -huh. It's a type of ice cream sundae. Can you only eat them on Sundays? Oh. Ho, ho. Not that type of sundae. You can eat them any time. Uh -huh. I'll show you. Uh -huh. We need ice cream, fruit, Meringue and cream. <laughs> Pepper and George add all the ingredients into the glass. Oh. And now you can decorate the top. Yay! Then decorate with wafers, colourful sprinkles and sauce. Here you are, ah, madam. This looks wonderful. <laughs> now everyone has been served, what kind of ice cream would you two like? Hmm. A rainbow one. Rainbow. Pepper and George use lots of different <laughs> coloured ice cream. Pink for strawberry, brown for chocolate, yellow for banana. Nana. Then they add their toppings. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Let's mix it all together. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Pepper and George have mixed all the colours together. We've made a muddy puddle, ah. not rainbow ice cream. I'm afraid we don't have much ice cream left. All we have is... Vanilla! My favourite! <laughs> Peppa and George like making special ice creams, but they love vanilla ice cream the most. <laughs> it's Valentine's Day. Peppa and George are making a special dinner Whoops. for Mummy and Daddy Pig. Grandpa Pig is helping. My goodness! We're making special Valentine's Day pizzas, Granny Pig. Because Valentine's Day is all about showing others that you love them. I know! We can make the pizzas heart-shaped. <laughs> <laughs> now, we toss the dough up into the air, just like they do in Roma. That's a place in Italy, you know. <laughs> Aha! Hmm. Whoops! <laughs> just like in Roma. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. We can cover the lumpy bits with some vegetables <gasps> from the garden. Oh. Mummy and Daddy Pig are not sure what's going on. Peppa and George are collecting vegetables. The pizzas are going to have lots of toppings. Oh. <laughs> Let's take the vegetables inside. Peppa and George add vegetables to their pizza. I know how to make the pizzas even more special. We can add Mummy and Daddy Pig's favourite foods. Good idea, Peppa. What are their favourite foods? <laughs> Spaghetti and chocolate cake. <laughs> 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 Yay! We should make the pizzas look like Mummy and Daddy. Peppa and George make faces with the pizza toppings. <laughs> now 
they're really special. <laughs> oh, George! <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> Here are your extra special Valentine's Day pizzas. <sighs> Chocolate cake? My favourite! <laughs> dinosaur! A spaghetti dinosaur! Thank you, Pepper and George. <laughs> they look too good to eat. Mummy and Daddy Pig think their Valentine pizzas are very special indeed. Today, Peppa and her classmates are visiting a chocolate factory. Can I try some chocolate, please, Miss Rabbit? You can, Peppa. Yay! But we've got to make it first. Oh. <laughs> Peppa is very excited to make chocolate. How do we make it, Miss Rabbit? With this machine. Hello, machine. Can you make me some chocolate, please? <gasps> Thank you, machine. Yay! Now can I try some of it, please? Not yet, Peppa. We need to decorate it first. Follow me. Hooray! Everyone is very excited to decorate the chocolate, too. You can decorate one chocolate bar each. Ooh, it looks like a muddy puzzle. <laughs> yes, but don't jump in it, Peppa. And you can add whatever decorations you like from the table as long as it's yummy. Mine is a carroty chocolate bar. <laughs> Delicious! Mine is a cheesy chocolate bar. Squeak! Yum, yum! And mine is a spaghetti chocolate bar. Oh. Because strawberry laces look like spaghetti. <laughs> Phew! Scrumptious! Can I try some chocolate now, please, Miss Rabbit? Almost, Peppa. The chocolate needs to cool in the fridge first. The fridge is very cold and makes the liquid chocolate oh. harden into bars. And done. Yay! Yay! Oh. Can we please try some chocolate now, Miss Rabbit? Not yet, Pep. Oh, wait. Yes, you can. <gasps> Hmm. Is something wrong, Peppa? No. I just really liked it when the chocolate was all runny like a muddy puddle. Oh, ho, ho. then it's lucky I have one more treat for you Yay! all. It's... <laughs> a chocolate fountain! It's just like a giant chocolate muddy puddle. And lots of nice healthy fruit to dip too. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> Peppa loves muddy puddles, especially when they're made out of chocolate. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her friends are going to the sweet shop. Hello, Miss Rabbit. I'd like to buy everything in the sweet shop, please. Here is my coin. Peppa and her friends each have one coin to buy a sweet with. Here is my coin, too. And mine. And mine. Wow, what a lot of money. But I'm afraid it's not enough to buy everything in the shop. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> One coin is perfect for trying my new sweet-making machines, though. Ooh. Just choose a machine, pop your coin in the slot and push the big red button. Mmm, strawberry laces! Nay! But strawberries are fruits, not sweets. My sweets are made with delicious real fruit. Much tastier and much healthier. Yummy strawberries! They look like hair! <laughs> You're right! I've got a strawberry ponytail! <laughs> <laughs> my turn! My turn! Emily Elephant has found a rainbow lollipop machine. For this machine, you have to push the buttons to choose your favourite fruity flavours. Hmm... Yellow banana! Ooh, you love red apples! 
And pink raspberries. And blue blueberries. And green apples. <laughs> <laughs> you like all the flavours. <laughs> <laughs> That's a candy floss machine. Why don't you pop your coin in and give it a go? Oh. Mm, it tastes like coconut. <laughs> it looks just like you, Susie. And now it looks even more like you. <laughs> <gasps> what is that? Only one way to find out. But I thought this was a sweetie machine, not a money machine. <gasps> Can I use this to buy some real sweeties? You don't need to. That coin is a sweetie pepper. It's a chocolate coin. Chocolate! Hooray! <laughs> Peppa loves a sweet treat from the sweet shop. Everyone loves a sweet treat from the sweet shop. Peppa and her family have bought lots of food at the supermarket. And now they have very rumbly tummies. <laughs> What's for dinner? My tummy's making lots of noises. Tonight we're making tacos. Yay! What's a taco? And how do you make them? <laughs> it's a delicious food from Mexico. And the best way to make tacos is all together. <laughs> Pepper, George and Mummy Pig are washing vegetables for their tacos. Let's make sure the vegetables are nice and clean. Splish, splash, wish, wash, wash the veggies clean. Splish. Splash, wish, wash, wash the veggies, please. Splash, 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 splash. Now, Peppa and Mummy Pig are nice and clean too. Now the vegetables are clean, we can carefully slice some onions. Here you go, Daddy. <laughs> What's wrong, Daddy? Don't you like onions? Oh, don't worry, Peppa. The juice from the onion sometimes makes your eyes water. I just need something to cover my eyes. I know. Pepper knows a perfect way to protect their eyes from the onions. These are perfect, Pepper. Ah, onions again, Daddy Pig. <laughs> <laughs> now we'll make some guacamole. Hooray! I love guacamole. Then you can mash the avocado, Peppa. Peppa likes <laughs> mashing the avocado. It's very fun and messy. Oops! <laughs> Perhaps try a bit more gently, Peppa? Perfect! Now we mix in other ingredients. And add a very special squeeze of lime. Squeeze! <laughs> All right, George. You can add the special squeeze. Yay! Oh, it's a good job I'm wearing my safety goggles. <laughs> now all the ingredients are ready, it's time to put the tacos together. This is the best bit. Take your tortilla like this. And add your favourite ingredients. Peppa likes her taco with lots of guacamole. George likes his taco empty. Mummy and Daddy Pig like their tacos with everything. Mm. Everyone thinks the tacos are very tasty. <gasps> but they've all dropped their filling. Hooray! Now we can put them together again. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her playgroup are at a juice factory. They're learning how juice is made. And this is the fruit squeezer. It squeezes all the juice out of the oranges. Can I try squeezing oranges, Miss Rabbit? Of course. You can all try. Hooray! 
Everyone is having lots of fun squeezing the oranges. But it is very hard work. <laughs> My hands are tired. That's OK, because next up, we have the juice stomper. Oh. The stomper has big boots to stomp out all the juice from the strawberries. Oh, can I try stomping Miss Rabbit? Yes. Everyone can try. Hooray! Pop these boots on and stomp away. <laughs> it's just like jumping in muddy puddles. Well done, everyone. Now follow me. This is where the juice is put into cartons. We have to match the flavour with the picture on the cartons. What flavour is this one? It's red. Is it strawberry? Well done, Mandy. Press the red button to fill it up. <laughs> and how about this one? It's green. So... Apple! <laughs> Spot on, Susie. And this one? It's mm. lots of colours. <laughs> <laughs> Well done, Peppa. You've created a brand new type of juice. It's rainbow juice. <laughs> Everyone thinks the rainbow juice looks very delicious indeed. This is the tasting room. It's where we make sure all the juice tastes scrum diddly umptious. But to make it fun, you have to guess what flavour each juice is. Peppa and her playgroup love tasting <laughs> juice. Ah, yum! This is orange uh -huh. juice. Mmm! <laughs> this is apple juice. Ah. Ah. Mm. This tastes like all the juices at once. That's because it's your special rainbow <gasps> juice. Yum, yum, yum. Peppa loves learning about juice. And Peppa really loves her delicious rainbow juice. Today, Peppa and her family have been at the supermarket. Outside the supermarket is a toy machine. Yay! Ooh! Mandy Mouse has got a toy. Well done, Mandy. Peppa, George, would you like a go on the toy machine? Yes, please. How does it work, Miss Rabbit? You just buy a token and put it in the slot. Then a ball rolls all the way down to the bottom of the machine and there's a <laughs> special surprise toy inside. Dinosaur! George would like to get a dinosaur toy. How fun! You can have one try each. Here you go. Yay! <laughs> Yay! George's token makes the machine light up and play music. A ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. Whoa! Oh. George has got a toy screwdriver. A screwdriver! How useful! Dinosaur. Don't worry, George. I'll try to get the dinosaur too. Now, Peppa's token <laughs> makes the machine light up and a different ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. <laughs> oh. Peppa hasn't got the dinosaur, but she has got some very nice stickers. Dinosaur! What lovely toys you got. <gasps> but look, our ice cream is starting to melt. So close. I have a feeling the dinosaur will come out next time. <laughs> Please, can we have one more go, Mummy? Please! Oh, go on then. <laughs> one more try. Hooray! <laughs> Peppa and George pull the lever on the toy machine. But this time, no balls pop out. Oh! <laughs> Oh dear, I wanted to see what toy you were going to get. Not to worry, <gasps> Mummy Pig. 
I can fix it. I just need to find my screwdriver. Nope. Nope. Screwdriver. <gasps> ah, oh, thank you, George. <laughs> <gasps> Yay! Oh, whoops! <laughs> Miss Rabbit has fixed the machine too much. Now all the balls have fallen out. I'd better put these back, but I think you earned this for helping me fix the machine. <gasps> Dinosaur! <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This is for you. Eh? <gasps> <laughs> Everyone loves the toy machine, and George really loves dinosaurs. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family have been shopping at the supermarket. Goodbye, supermarket. Supermarket. <laughs> Is that a robot? <laughs> no, Peppa. It's a vending machine. You put money in to buy the food and drinks inside. Can we buy something from the robot, please? <laughs> OK. We can each choose one thing as a special treat. Yay! Peppa is very excited to buy something from the robot vending machine. Here you go, Peppa. <laughs> Goodbye, coin. Now... Press the button that matches the thing you would like. I would like an orange juice. There it is. Hooray! Delicious. <laughs> dinosaur. George has found a biscuit shaped like a dinosaur. Here you go, George. Now, press the button with the dinosaur. <laughs> dinosaur! <gasps> <laughs> I think I will have... Hmm, that drink. Oh dear, it's stuck. Daddy Pig's drink is stuck on a sandwich. The sandwich is in the way. Naughty sandwich. We'll need to buy the sandwich as well, so the drink will fall down with it. Oh, it's stuck again. Naughty pineapple. Ah, let's buy that too. It's stuck again! Again! <laughs> the drink has finally fallen all the way down to the bottom. Goody! Yay! I can finally have my drink. <gasps> oh no! My drink has turned into fizz. Poor Daddy. Why don't you choose something else from the vending machine? Good idea. <gasps> oh, the vending machine is empty. That's because we bought everything. <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are playing grown-ups. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Where is my bag and my hat? We're off to work now, Mummy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and what job do you think you'd enjoy when you're grown up? Dinosaur! <laughs> George wants to be a dinosaur. Hmm, I think I would enjoy being a dentist. Then I will make sure everyone's teeth are nice and healthy. Hmm, interesting. Uh, 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 hang, all right. You've got lots of clean teeth, Mummy. Oh. Here's a sticker for being so brave. Don't forget to brush your teeth. Who's next? <gasps> 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 Silly 
George. Dinosaurs don't go to the dentist. <laughs> they go to Dr Hamster the vet. Wow! <laughs> but you can have a sticker anyway. <laughs> I think you'd make a very good dentist. <laughs> and you'd be an excellent dinosaur, George. But I'd also like to be a bus driver. Then I could take all my friends to the park. Tickets, please. Next stop, <laughs> the park. Stop! <gasps> you forgot <laughs> us. Come back. <laughs> <laughs> you have to stop at all the bus stops if you want to be a bus driver, Peppa. Oops, <gasps> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'd be a brilliant bus driver, Peppa. But I don't just want to be a dentist and a bus driver. I also want to be a teacher. Oh. <laughs> then I'll teach everybody how to paint. You can paint a butterfly using handprints like this. <gasps> dinosaurs don't go to school, George. Perhaps you could open a school for dinosaurs. But when I'm grown up, I also want to jump in muddy puddles. <laughs> <laughs> and George will be a dinosaur. And they will always love jumping in muddy puddles, even when they are grown up or dinosaurs. Hello. Hi. Peppa and her family have come to the balloon shop to collect a special balloon for a garden party. Miss Rabbit, can we have our fancy planet-friendly recyclable balloon? Whoa. Oh. Wow. Balloon. The balloon shop is full of balloons. Miss Rabbit? <laughs> bonk. Oh. Bonk. Bonk. oh, you found me. I've been lost in the balloon since Tuesday morning. Must be lunchtime by now. It's Wednesday, Miss Rabbit. Oh. Anyway, here are all your fancy, planet-friendly, recyclable balloons. <laughs> ready for the party. All? But we only ordered one. Hmm. Whoa! <laughs> um, it says here 1,000 balloons for Mummy Pig's party. Oh, but we don't need this many and we can't waste them. What do we do? I know. We can share them. Peppa and her family are giving one, the extra two. balloons to everyone in one town. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and one for both of you. Here you go. Red balloon. Green one for you. <laughs> <sighs> Only 992 to go. This is going to take forever. Uh-oh, and we have to go and set up the party. I have a great idea. Grab some balloons and follow me, everyone. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> it is time for the party, and everyone is beginning to arrive. <laughs> Hello, Susie. Here's your balloon. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Miss <laughs> 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 Rabbit has used the balloons to turn the garden party into a balloon party. Miss Rabbit can make anything with a balloon. <laughs> Or anyone. Here you go. <laughs> it looks like me. And this one looks like me. <laughs> this is the balloon ray. <laughs> 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 And don't worry if you pop a balloon, because we have lots of extras. Bonk! <gasps> bonk! <laughs> bonk! Bonk! Everyone would have loved Mummy Pig's garden party, but everyone loves the balloon party even more. <laughs> the 
treasure train is on its way. Choo choo! <laughs> Yay! Peppa Pig and Danny Dog are driving a train full of gold, silver, and broccoli. <laughs> is broccoli treasure? Yes, it's special broccoli made of sparkly diamonds. <laughs> Pepper and Danny aren't really driving a train. They're using their imagination to pretend. Hooray! Stop! <gasps> In the name of... Um... Robbers! <gasps> oh no! Pedro Pony and Susie Sheep are pretending to be train robbers. Can we have all your treasure, please? <laughs> no! Oh! OK. <laughs> You're supposed to steal the treasure, <laughs> Susie. Oh! Ha-ha! <laughs> <laughs> we have stolen all the treasure! Hooray! <sighs> um, what do we do now? You escape. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeehaw! <laughs> Come back, you naughty robbers! Now Peppa and Danny are pretending to be police officers. They're going to catch the robbers. Hey. You caught us! No, we didn't. Because, um... Ha! Your mm. boat can fly! Whoa. Um, Madame Gazelle, can ships fly? Real ships cannot fly. Oh! But pretend ships certainly can. Hooray! Wow! Now Pedro and Susie are in a flying boat. Oh, um... <gasps> Our train can fly too! Whee! Yay! <laughs> Uh-oh! <laughs> hey! Police officers Pepper and Danny have almost caught the robbers. <gasps> Time. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Is it a giant? <gasps> no, it's a daddy pig. And he's coming to take you home. <laughs> Charge! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing, Peppa? We're pretending to fly our boats and trains, Daddy. <laughs> oh, my! What an imaginative yeah. bunch you all are. Oh, aha! Peppa loves imagining things. Everyone loves imagining things. Today, Peppa is playing with her toy blocks. <gasps> Oop! Careful, George. This is a very small town Whoa. and you're a very giant dinosaur. That gives me an idea. Do you want to play giants, George? <laughs> George is very excited to play giants with Peppa. Hello, Police Officer Panda. What a lovely, quiet, normal day in Toyland. <laughs> and definitely no sign of... <gasps> Hello, I am Giant Peppa. <gasps> a giant! Two giants! <laughs> Peppa and George are imagining their giants in a pretend <laughs> toy block world. Hello, birds! Hello, clouds! <gasps> Hello, everyone! <gasps> <Whoa>. <gasps> Our ball is stuck in that very tall tree. We can help you with that. We are very tall giants. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Whoopsie. <laughs> oh, careful, George. <laughs> there you go, Susie. Hooray! Giant Pepper and Giant George <laughs> love to help their friends in Toyland. <gasps> They help the passengers Whee! to get on the bus. Oh, wee! 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 
and help the boats go very, very fast. <laughs> You broke earlier. Oh. Don't worry, we can fix it. <laughs> Pepper and George are experts with toy blocks. They fix the toy bridge in no time at all. Thanks, giant Pepper and giant George. Stop! Uh, I mean, go! Hooray! 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 Oh, goody! Hungry too. The food in Thailand is too small for Giant Pepper and Giant George. Whoa! Dinner time! Hooray! So they will have to have real food <gasps> instead. Careful, George! <laughs> Four tickets, please! Four popcorns, please! Four drinks, please. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family are at the cinema. Peppa's favourite book has been made into a movie. <laughs> Silly George, we're not seeing that scary ghost movie. Ours is really fun and not scary. Scary. Scary ghost <laughs> movies are only for grown-ups. Uh, oh, excuse me. Excuse Sorry. Me. Oh, uh, sorry. <sighs> <sighs> the seats in the cinema all fold up when they're not being used. But George's seat is folding up when he's sitting in it. Excuse me, coming through. Watch your toes. Luckily, Miss Rabbit has a special booster to hold the seat flat. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. No problem. Me again. <gasps> Who spilled popcorn? <laughs> George doesn't like it when the cinema gets dark. Whoosh, whoosh. Yay, it's starting! <gasps> <laughs> George doesn't like the loud sounds either. <gasps> it's the baddie. Yeah, me. Oh dear. George thinks the baddie in the movie is a bit scary. Maybe we should take George outside. But you can't miss the movie. Oh. Pepper has thought of a way to make the baddie less scary for George. Hello, George. It's me. I'm just pretending to be a buddy for the movie. I'm not really scary. Not scary? No. And this magic wand oh. will keep you extra safe. Wish! <laughs> <laughs> Plus, at the end of the story, everyone lives happily ever after. Ooh, happy! <laughs> Whoosh! Shh! <gasps> Sorry! Everyone <laughs> loves going to the cinema, and George really loves movies with happy endings. Today, Mummy and Peppa have brought George Yay! to the doctors for a checkup. <laughs> Hello, I'm Dr. Peppa Pig. <laughs> Hello, Dr. Peppa Pig. I'm Nurse Miss Rabbit. <laughs> and this is Dr. Brown Bear. Ready for your checkup, George? George has never been to the doctors before. He is a little nervous. Don't worry, George. The doctors just want to make sure you feel good. Exactly. Come on in and don't forget your little red book. <laughs> First, Miss Rabbit and Dr Brown Bear need to check George's height. 
Step this way, please, George. No! But George isn't sure he'll like the height measurer. <laughs> How tall am I, Miss Rabbit? Wow! You're getting very tall, Peppa. <gasps> You'll be a big grown-up soon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> George wants to know if he is very tall too. Wow, you're so big and tall, George. <laughs> now it's time to check George's weight <gasps> with a special machine called scales. <gasps> this machine will tell us how much you weigh, George. And it's really good <laughs> for bouncing. <laughs> George loves bouncing. <laughs> and freeze. <gasps> mm -hmm. And unfreeze. <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> Now it's time to listen to George's heart with a special tool called a oh. stethoscope. Oh. Mm. This might be a little cold. <laughs> the stethoscope is very cold. Oh, try this, George. <gasps> you can listen to my heartbeat too. George <laughs> likes listening to Peppa's heart. You did very well today, George. So you get a sticker. Oh. <gasps> oh. <laughs> and one for Dr. Pepper Pig for being so helpful too. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are at a fun fair. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. Have you been in the fun house yet? What's a fun house? It's a special fun fair house that has lots of silly rooms and funny hallways. <laughs> Can me and George go into the fun house, please? Please. Hello, Miss Rabbit. Two for the fun house. To enter the fun house, Mummy Pig must buy tokens from Miss um... Rabbit. But the tokens cost more coins than Mummy Pig thought. Oh. Thank you, Mummy Pig. Right this way. <laughs> Yay! Ooh! This is the rickety rackety bridge. Pass through to see the rest of the fun house. <laughs> Peppa is moving very slowly and carefully across the bridge. But George thinks it's fun to go very fast. <laughs> Your way is much better, George. Whee! <laughs> Congratulations! Now you need to follow the arrows. This way, George. <laughs> <laughs> These mirrors are so wobbly. The funhouse mirrors make <laughs> Peppa and George look very silly indeed. This mirror makes me look so tall. And you look like you have a very big head, George. <laughs> that one makes you look really round. Round! And this mirror makes me look like Miss Rabbit. That's because I am Miss Rabbit. <gasps> <laughs> Follow me to the twisty, turny tunnel. <laughs> the funhouse tunnel spins round and round. Ooh! Whee! And it's very windy. <laughs> <laughs> Look! After the tunnel, we get to go down the slide. Yay! I'll help you, George. <laughs> I wonder what's taking so long. I hope they're not lost. <laughs> How was it? The fun house was really fun. How fitting. Everyone <laughs> loves the fun house because the fun house is very fun. Today, 
Mummy Pig is going for a relaxing day at the spa. <laughs> oh, sorry, Mummy Pig. I've got to close early today. I've got the sniffles. Oh, I was really looking forward to my spa day. Why don't we make a spa at home? Oh, that's a great idea, Peppa. Peppa is very good at having ideas. Hello, Mrs Mummy. Welcome to the spa. Oh! <laughs> Peppa has turned the living room into a very wow. special spa. First we are going to, um... What happens at the spa, Mummy? Well, we normally start with a nice cup of lemon water. I can do that. <laughs> I'll get you some lemony water, <laughs> Mrs. Mummy. Here you go. Oh. <laughs> oh. Mmm. Thank you, Peppa. This is the lemoniest water I've ever seen. What's next? Next, I'd like to have a foot bath. Yay! Hey! What's a foot bath? It's a very small bath just for your feet. OK, <laughs> time for your very small bath just for your feet, Mrs Mummy. Come on, Daddy. <laughs> Peppa and Daddy Pig are making their very own foot bath. This ought to do the trick. <laughs> ah, that's so relaxing. <gasps> Peppa has turned the foot bath into a regular bath. <laughs> Here are the boats you ordered, Miss Pepper. <laughs> you have to have bubbles and toys in the bath. <laughs> Wonderful! <laughs> I'll suggest this to Miss Rabbit. What's next, Mummy? Next, it's time for a massage. Uh, um... Here, lie down on the sofa and I'll show you how it works. Pepper finds the massage very tickly. <laughs> Your turn, Mummy. Oh, it's very different to my normal massage. It's a special pepper <laughs> massage. <laughs> Choo -choo. Now, the last thing I do at the spa is have a mud mask, which is... A mask made of mud. Yes, a special spa mud that's good for your skin. I don't think we have any special spa mud here, though. I've got an idea. Peppa is very, very good at having ideas. We don't need spa mud when we've got muddy puddles. <laughs> <laughs> They're just like muddy puddle face masks. <laughs> Peppa loves a spa day, especially when it involves jumping in muddy puddles. <laughs> Watch out! Today, Peppa and her friends are at the water park. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello, Hello Miss Rabbit. Rabbit. <laughs> Before you all go swimming, I have some important rules to teach you. Miss Rabbit is telling everyone how to be safe in the swimming pool. The first rule is no splashing. <laughs> no splashing, Mr Bull. Whoops! Sorry, Pepper. Sorry, Miss Rabbit. That's OK, Mr Bull. The second rule is no running. <laughs> Silly, Mr Bull. No running. Sorry again. Mr Bull doesn't know any of the rules. And the last rule is... Everyone must have a simply splendid time. Oh! Ooh. Have a splendid time, Mr Bull. Oh, ho, ho, ho! Right you are, Peppa! Enjoy the pool, everyone. What shall we do first? Let's go on the water slide. Hooray! Everyone is very excited to ride the water slides. <laughs> Hello again. Who wants to go down the slide? Me! <laughs> well, you're in luck. There is one slide for each of you. Let's have a race. 
good idea. Lucky I brought my flag. On your marks, get set, go! And Danny Dog zooms into the lead, followed by Pepper. Then it's Gerald Giraffe and Susie Sheep coming up behind. It's incredibly close. Water slide racing at its best. Hello, Granny. Hello, Mr. Bull. <laughs> oh. They're nearly at the finish line. It's neck and neck. Who will come out on top? It's a draw. Everybody wins. Peppa and her friends love the slides, but they have forgotten the first rule of the water park. Uh -huh. No, no splashing. It is morning, and Pepper is having some delicious breakfast. Oh. What's happened to the cereal? <laughs> April Fools! <laughs> April Fools? What's that? Today is April Fools' Day. It's a day where people make each other laugh by playing silly jokes. Like I just did with your cereal. I like silly jokes. <laughs> Can we do one on Daddy? That's a great idea. Daddy Pig is reading on the sofa, but Mummy Pig and Pepper have come to play a joke on him. Could you please pass my glasses, Mummy Pig? Of course. Pepper and Mummy Pig are playing a joke on Daddy Pig. Thank you. <laughs> That's strange. These glasses have made it even harder to see. April Fools! <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. oh, these are joke glasses. Very funny, but you won't be able to play another joke on me. I am much too clever for that. Peppa <laughs> is playing another joke on Daddy Pig. Oh, no. Huh? I can't open this tube of crisps. Can you help me, Daddy? Of course, Peppa. Whoa! Oh, 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 oh. That gave me a fright. <laughs> April <laughs> Fools! <laughs> you got me again, Pepper. Well done. <laughs> Would you like to help me play an April Fools Day joke on Mummy Pig, Pepper? <laughs> Pepper and her family have finished mm. dinner and are now eating dessert. <laughs> Aha! Me and Pepper have made a tasty chocolate cake for dessert, haven't we, Pepper? Yes. <laughs> How lovely! It looks delicious. <laughs> <laughs> My fork doesn't seem to work. <laughs> Try with your hands. Pepper and Daddy are playing a joke on Mummy Pig. <gasps> this isn't a cake. This is a sponge with icing on it. April, April Fools! Fools. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> what a clever joke. That reminds me. George brought some biscuits for you, Pepper. <laughs> Thank you, George. I love biscuits. <laughs> April Fools! Peppa <laughs> loves April Fools' Day. Everyone loves April Fools' Day. <laughs> Peppa and Susie are pretending to be police officers. <laughs> police, we'll help you. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, police officers. You're welcome. Now we must get back to solving crimes. Nino! Nino! Oh, my! What is it, Madam Gazelle? I think my special pen has gone missing. <gasps> this sounds like a mystery. Ah. Don't worry. Me and Police Officer Susie will solve the case. <laughs> 
Peppa and Susie are looking for clues to find the special pen. They're using a magnifying glass to make small things look bigger. Aha! Purple! That's the oh. same colour oh. as Danny oh. Dog's T-shirt! <gasps> Have you seen oh. the special pen, Danny? I don't think so. Well, we'd better take you to the police station to ask you some questions. Peppa and Susie have made a pretend police station so they can ask everyone questions about the missing pen. <laughs> it's made from books and pillows. This police station doesn't even have doors. It's a nice place to read, though. Peppa and Susie are asking everybody about the special pen. Oh. They've brought Candy Cat to the pretend police station. Candy Cat, can you Remember what colour the special pen is? Hmm, red? No, green! Actually, pink! No, uh, blue! Aha! You've been very helpful. Let's take a big look around. The special blue pen must be <gasps> hidden somewhere. Pepper and Susie are searching everywhere for the special pen. Ah! Oh, but they can't find it anywhere. I can't find it anywhere. Hmm, I have an idea. Now, Madam Gazelle is answering questions at the pretend police station. When did you last see your pen, Madam Gazelle? Well, let's see. I used it this morning, then I put it behind my ear. Oh, my! Yay! Madam Gazelle's special <laughs> pen has been behind her ear all along. We found it! We solved the mystery! <laughs> Hooray! Thank you for helping me, Peppa and Susie. I think you would make very good police <gasps> officers. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family have come to London to watch Super Potato, the musical. Goodness! We better get walking, or we'll miss the start of the show. Oh no! We're going to get all wet. Not to worry, we can take the underground train instead. Hooray! The underground train is underground. <laughs> it never rains underground. <laughs> and there is a colourful map that shows where all the trains go. It looks like spaghetti. <laughs> So, we are here, and we need to get here. We can take the blue train first, and then... Take the red train. Yes, well done, Peppa. Off we go. First, Peppa must have her ticket checked by the ticket barrier. <laughs> Thank you, ticket robot. I'm stuck. Hold tight, Peppa. I'll get you out. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This way, Peppa. Follow the blue line, everyone. Um, I'm stuck too. <laughs> the train is arriving at the platform from a very dark tunnel. The train oh. is very, very busy. Why is everybody rushing? They are in a hurry. Everyone on the underground train is in a hurry. On we go. Watch your step, everyone. Hello, everyone. Welcome aboard the blue train. Mind the doors. Hold on, Peppa. The underground train is very bumpy. <laughs> <laughs> on your left, you'll see under the ground. And on your right, you'll see even more under the ground. Change here for the red train. The red train? That's us. Watch your step, George. Hold tight, everyone. We're here, we're here. The 
the show starts in a few minutes, we might miss the beginning. Oh, no, you won't. Follow me. I'll get you to Super Potato the Musical on time, or my name isn't... Super Potato! Hooray! <laughs> Big celebrity coming through! Make way for the star, thank you! <laughs> no autographs today! Super Potato is in a hurry, too. Everyone on the underground train is in a hurry. A super strike for a super bowler! Today, Susie Sheep is having a bowling party. <laughs> I want to get a super strike too! I know how to do it. I've been bowling lots of times. Then you can show everyone what to do, Peppa. OK. We should take our pictures for the scoreboard. <laughs> Just step in front of the camera and say cheese. Cheese! Perfect. This is your bowling lane. Ooh. Now you shoot the bowling ball. Then you throw it straight ahead. Like this. Yay! <laughs> I'm going to try. I like this one. The pink ball is very heavy. <laughs> try this one instead. It's lighter. Whoa! Hmm. Oh. Crikey! Anyone lost a ball? Oh, no. I'll try next. Oh. Pedro Pony's ball has gone into the gutter at the side of the lane. Whoops! My turn. Whoa! Susie Sheep, Pedro Pony and Gerald Giraffe haven't quite got the hang of bowling yet. Don't worry, we need to find a better way to play. Hmm. Why don't you try with the barriers up this time? It's another fun way to play. Try Pedro. Okay, but I don't want my bowling ball to bounce. No problem. You can use a ramp to help the ball roll in a straight line. <laughs> oh, this is fun! <laughs> Yay! Pepper and her friends are having lots of fun bowling in their own ways. <laughs> But Susie Sheep still wants to get a super strike. All right, everyone. It's your last bowl. Good luck. <laughs> What's this? Susie Sheep is bowling backwards. Oh. <gasps> a super strike for a super bowler. Hooray! Susie Sheep has got a super strike. Susie Sheep loves bowling. Everyone loves bowling. Pretty cool, eh, Pepper? <laughs> Daddy, we're getting shoes for George, not you. Oh, yes. Today, George is buying <laughs> some new shoes. Hello, Miss Rabbit. We need some new shoes for George. George's shoes are very old. Well, you're in luck. The shoe shop has lots of shoes. We'll find George the perfect pair. Hooray! First, we need to measure your feet. Pop your foot in the measurer, please. <laughs> Miss Rabbit is measuring George's feet to help him find shoes that are the right size. Your feet are very small. That's because George is a baby. <laughs> no. George is not a baby. Follow oh. me. <laughs> oh. We keep all our very small shoes over here. Which shoes do you ah. like, George? Shoes. <laughs> Those are bowling shoes. George <laughs> loves to oh. go bowling. And he oh. loves bowling <laughs> shoes. Are you sure you want those shoes, George? <laughs> shoes! Shoes! 
Those are tap dancing Aha. shoes. Aha. They're very noisy. <laughs> George loves to make lots of noise. Maybe too noisy. <laughs> shoes. They are clown shoes. Uh -huh. George oh. loves clown Whoa. shoes. Whoa. <laughs> They're too big. And George is very small. Oh. Uh, shoes! Shoes! George tries on lots of shoes. <laughs> Tall ones. Little ones. Yay! And even silly ones. But none of them are quite right. <laughs> they are slippers, George. They are not shoes. <laughs> shoes! These are just like your old <gasps> shoes. Shoes! George would like <gasps> new shoes that are just <laughs> like his old shoes. Jolly good. We'll take them, please, Miss Rabbit. Miss Rabbit? Phew! I'm under here! Oh. Shoes! George loves his new shoes and he loves the shoe shop. Everyone loves the shoe shop. Hmm. Hello, everybody! <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family have come to a concert of Madame Gazelle's band, the Rocking Gazelles. I can't see. Anything. How about now? Hooray! Thank you! <laughs> oh dear! Gerald Giraffe is also on his daddy's shoulders and is blocking everyone's view. Oh! Hi, Peppa! <laughs> hi, George! Gerald and his daddy have moved to the side, so now everyone can see. <laughs> With a one and two and one, two, three, four! Yay! Everyone is having a wonderful time. Peppa and Daddy Pig are really enjoying the music. Are you having fun, Peppa? Yes! Are you having fun, George? George? Peppa and Daddy Pig have accidentally ended up <laughs> in the middle of the crowd. We'll come and find you soon, Mummy Pig. I said we'll come and find you soon. But I don't need a spoon. Have fun, George. Whee! Everyone is dancing. It's like being in a big dancing swimming pool. Ho, ho, ho. There are even some inflatable beach balls. Got it. Well done, Peppa. <laughs> Oh. Oops. Sorry, Mr. Bull. Sorry, Madam Gazelle. Not to worry. Happens all the time. That's okay. I love pop music. In fact, it reminds me of my next song. One, two, three, four. Pop, pop, popping bubbles, popping bubbles, popping all the way. Pop, pop, popping bubbles. Mummy and George Pig have danced all the way to the front of the concert, too. Madame Gazelle has invited Peppa and her family to join them on stage. <laughs> pop, pop, popping bubbles, popping bubbles, popping away. Pop, pop, popping bubbles, popping bubbles, popping bubbles, popping bubbles all day. Everyone loves Madame Gazelle's concert, and everyone really loves pop pop popping bubbles. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her friends are at a go kart track. Hello, everybody. Who's ready to race go karts? Me! 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 Oh, I am. 
Peppa and her friends put on their race suits. <laughs> Red is my favourite colour. Ooh. And don't forget your safety helmets. Now, let's pick your go-karts. Yay! <laughs> Danny Dog has put his helmet on backwards. <laughs> <laughs> now, the pedals make the go-kart go And the brakes make it stop And the steering wheel helps the go-kart turn It's just like riding a bike Why don't you all give it a try and start pedalling slowly? I drive a big car all the time. A go-kart should be easy. Whoa! Whoa! Oh dear, I think I went a little bit too fast. Now, how do I turn around? <laughs> <laughs> the go-kart race has begun. <laughs> this is fun! But Susie Sheep is pedalling backwards. Try pedalling forward, Susie. Forward? Oh! <laughs> Woohoo! Danny Dog is pedalling very quickly. <gasps> Remember to use the brake, Danny. <laughs> Mummy Pig is having trouble Ooh. making her go-kart go. Let's see. This makes it go backwards. Do you need help, Mummy Pig? Oh, no thank you, Miss Rabbit. I'm sure I can do it. My go-kart is too wiggly. Peppa is driving all over the racetrack. Turn the steering wheel more gently, Peppa. Oh, much better. Peppa and her friends like driving around the racetrack in their go-karts. There we go! Whee! And Mummy Pig has finally got her go-kart moving. <laughs> Time's up! Well done, everybody! Hooray! But the go-kart race has finished. Oh. Peppa and her friends love racing go-karts. <laughs> and that's how you play shuffleboard. My puck landed at the bottom, so I get one point. Wow. Today on the cruise, Peppa and her family are learning to play shuffleboard. Now, Grandpa Pig can either knock my puck away or slide his into the triangle and get points. Let's give it a go. Grandpa Pig has knocked Granny Pig's puck into George's sand. That's two points for me. Can I try next? Yes, use this cue stick and push the puck into the triangle. Hmm. Ugh. Oh, it didn't move very much. Why don't you try giving yourself a running start? Good idea. Peppa is taking a big uh, run up. Uh, but the sand uh, is very slippery. <laughs> I didn't get any points. Not to worry. It's about having fun, not scoring points. Besides, no one is an expert their first time. <laughs> well done, show. George. I'll <laughs> just have to keep trying. <laughs> Peppa is trying lots of different ways of sliding the puck. My ice cream! Aha! Uh -huh. uh. But uh. nothing seems to be working. Ah! <laughs> uh. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. 
At least you missed my ice cream cone this time. Oh, oh dear. My turn, Peppa. Here you go, Granny. Ah. Granny's puck has pushed Peppa's puck into the triangle. I got three points. Hooray! Peppa <laughs> is very excited ah. to keep practicing. But there are no pucks left to play with. Oh. <laughs> George has used them to complete his sandcastle. Everyone loves playing shuffleboard, but George loves making sandcastles even more. Today, Peppa and George are helping Daddy Pig tidy some old boxes. <laughs> What's this, Daddy? Ah, that's my trusty old camera, Peppa. You press the button to take a picture. Cheese! And it prints the photo out. Look, I can see it. Can I have a go, please? <laughs> Say cheese! Cheese! Now Peppa is taking photos with the camera. This camera is really fun. Camera! Have fun! But there isn't much photo paper left, so use it wisely. George loves taking lots of photos. <laughs> oh dear, it's run out of photo paper. Oh, but I love taking pictures. Hmm. Why don't we use my phone's camera instead? It can even add filters to a photo. <laughs> Daddy Pig's phone camera has given George a pretend moustache. <laughs> Come on, George. Let's take more photos. Peppa and George are having lots of fun taking pictures. The phone camera has given Mummy Pig a flowery filter. Say cheese. Oh. And Grandpa Pig has a very fine hat. <laughs> Pepper, George and Daddy Pig have come to the park to take even more photos. <laughs> Hello, Mr and Mrs Bird. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Cheese! <laughs> what a funny photo! Daddy Pig wants to take a photo with Peppa and George by the ducks. Say cheese, everybody! One, two, three, cheese! <laughs> Peppa and George are sticking all the photos from the day into a scrapbook. Look at this one, George. But some of the photos are blurry. Oh. The photos don't have to be perfect. They just have to remind you of a lovely day. Everyone loves taking photos and everyone has had a very lovely day. George! Tonight, George is having a sleepover with Edmund Elephant and Richard Rabbit. All right, everyone. Time for bed. Don't worry, Mummy. I'll make sure they all go to sleep. Thank you, Peppa. <laughs> Come on, then. Into your sleeping bags. Quick march. Peppa likes being in charge. Well done, Peppa. Good night, everyone. Good night. <laughs> Only joking. <gasps> you can't go to sleep yet. There's lots of fun things you have to do first. <gasps> George has never had a sleepover before. He is very excited. First, we have to have a midnight feast. Ah! Ooh. Oh, you've turned into ghosts. <laughs> I know a spooky story about ghosts. George, Richard and Edmund <laughs> love stories. This is a ghost story about a muddy puddle that wasn't muddy. Ahem! Paranormal apparitions or 
Ghosts, as they're commonly known, do not exist. It is scientifically impossible. Uh... Edmund is a clever clogs. He doesn't believe in ghosts. Can I tell a story? Um, OK. <coughs> Ahem. Once upon a time, there was a giant pig and a, a very small rabbit. Squeak, squeak, squeak! And they chased each other forever and ever. <laughs> the end. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good story. Oh, I've got another one. This one is about... George, Edmund and Richard have turned into ghosts again. <laughs> Silly George. <sighs> oh, do you know what's next? Yay! We have to stay up very late until, <sighs> um, 100 o'clock. Ready? Oh. <sighs> I don't think George understands sleepovers. <laughs> How's everything going, Peppa? They're fast asleep, Mummy. Well done. I think you've earned a midnight feast. Hooray! George and his friends like playing sleepover games, but they love to sleep. Hey! Hi! <gasps> Whoops! Sorry, everyone! Today, Peppa and Mummy Pig have come to Miss Rabbit's yoga class. Namaste, everyone! Mm. Namaste oh. is how you say hello in a yoga class. Please take off your shoes and find a mat. Does anyone know what yoga is? Is it where you balance on one leg? Or when you bend into funny shapes? Almost. Yoga is a fun kind of exercise that helps you feel zen. Hmm. Which means relax. Oh. oh, we'd like to be zen. Please. Uh -huh. <laughs> Let's start with some breathing. Everyone close your eyes and breathe in slowly through your nose. One, two, three. And out through your mouths. One, two, three. Everyone is finding breathing one, two, very relaxing. Three, but and Emily and her mummy's trunks one, two, are making little three. whistle sounds. <laughs> <laughs> now let's do some stretching. Reach up high into the sky. <laughs> and bend down and touch your toes. <laughs> Pepper, Danny and Emily are all very good at stretching. But the grown-ups are finding it a little trickier. <sighs> You're very good at yoga, Mr Bull. I've had lots of practice. <sighs> and relax. <sighs> Everyone lay down on your front, then lift your chest up. This is oh. called... Cobra pose. Oh. Is this right? That's perfect. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't need to do the sounds. Now place your hands and feet on the ground and your hips up as high as you can, like this. This is called downward dog. That's perfect, Danny. You're a natural. Finally, everyone stand up straight. Put your hands together and lift one leg to the other leg. This is called tree pose. Peppa loves all the poses. <laughs> but balancing is quite hard. <laughs> Sorry, Miss Rabbit. My tree was a bit wobbly. No need to apologise, Peppa. Yoga is to help feel relaxed and zen. And nothing is more relaxing than a good giggle. Peppa loves yoga class and Peppa really loves laughing. Boom! Whoa! Oof. April Fools! Today is April Fools' Day <laughs> and Peppa is playing some jokes. 
Ho, ho, ho. Well done, Peppa. You gave me a jolly good fright. Would you like to play some jokes with me, Daddy? Yes, please. I love playing jokes. We can all play jokes. <laughs> Peppa and her family are going to play some jokes around the town. Mr Bull and his team are hard at work. Ah! Ooh! All right, lads. Who wants a slice of cake? Mmm! Ah. Nothing better than a yummy, gooey, chocolatey... Whoa! The cake was really a balloon covered in icing. A balloon? In my cake? Ah! April, April Fool's! <laughs> oh! Good one, Pepper. Thank you, Mr Bull. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> now, where's my real cake gone? Dr Hamster is shining Tiddles the tortoise's shell. Hmm. Now, where did I leave my shell polish? <laughs> April Fool's! <laughs> That's a very good joke. But where did the teeth go? Oh. Tiddles likes his new teeth. <laughs> <laughs> Gasp! A Brussels sprout in need of rescue. Have no fear, little guy. I'm here to... Ooh, now I'm here to... Ooh, uh, not quite. <laughs> Silly super potato. Gotcha! You're safe now. Gasp! April, April Fools! Fools. <laughs> oh, ha <laughs> ha! What a super joke, Peppa! And what a super sprout! Peppa's had lots of fun playing <laughs> jokes, but now it's time to go home. That was lots and lots of fun. Come on, George, let's jump in that muddy puddle. Stop! Sorry, Peppa, but you can't jump in muddy puddles anymore, I'm afraid. Too dangerous. <gasps> but jumping in muddy puddles is my favourite. Only joking. April, April Fools! <laughs> 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 Peppa and her family are flying in an aeroplane. Woohoo! Yay! I love flying in aeroplanes. <laughs> but not everyone loves flying in aeroplanes. <laughs> oh, hello, Madam Gazelle. George and I love flying. <laughs> Do you love it too? Actually, I have never been on an aeroplane before. And I am scared. Huh? Oh. Oh. Hmm. Oh, I know what to do. Miss Rabbit, please can you make the plane go really, really high? I don't see why not. Oh. It's really fun when the plane goes high, Madam Gazelle. Look, we're nearly in space. Oh. Whee! Oh, too high! Too high! Oh. Can we go lower instead, Miss Rabbit? Certainly. Oh! Whee! Do a loop de loop. Oh! <laughs> I don't think that worked either, George. <gasps> Look, Madam Gazelle, oh. that cloud is shaped like a bird. Do you see? Yes, I see. <gasps> and that one is shaped like a relaxing desert island. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's no good. I will just close my eyes and wait for this to be over. 
Oh, dear. Hello. Would you two like an activity book? They're lots of fun. Ooh. Oh, yes, please. Would you like to oh. do some colouring in with us, Madam Gazelle? Well, I suppose that might keep my mind off things. And so Pepper, George and Madam Gazelle did some relaxing colouring for the rest of the flight. Look at these! The line work, the attention to detail. Incredible! A star plus! Oh, hooray! We've landed! Whee! Already? But I was having fun! That wasn't scary at all! I told you, flying is really fun! Thank you for helping me, Peppa and George. Now I cannot wait to fly home. <laughs> Peppa and Rebecca Rabbit are making a pillow fort today. Careful, don't fall on the fort. Almost got it. Whoa. Squeak. We did it. Now we need to decorate the inside. Hmm, something else is missing. Oh, something to eat! <laughs> Mummy! What a beautiful pillow fort! Can we have something to eat, please? Of course! I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Let's pretend the pillow fort is really big inside. Wow! <laughs> Catch, Peppa! <laughs> Let's pretend the floor is really bouncy, like a trampoline. Squeak! <laughs> it's so bouncy! <laughs> oh, no! The ball bounced over there. Let's bounce after it. Uh, uh. This floor is green, so let's pretend it's squelchy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but the ball isn't here. Maybe over there. <laughs> <laughs> this room is blue, so let's pretend it's cold. <laughs> There's the ball. Hooray! L let's get out of here. Um, which way did we c come in? Peppa, where are you? We're lost in the pillow fort. I'll come get you. No, Mummy. The fort isn't built for grown-ups. <laughs> oh, I can fit through anything. Uh, uh. Mummy Pig is stuck. Oh. Uh, uh. Mummy, your wiggles are breaking the fall. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Phew. Ooh. All that pretending has made me even more hungry. Good thing I brought you some food. Now, we just need to find it under these pillows. <laughs> <laughs> Grandpa, George, where are you? <laughs> Today, Peppa is playing in the garden with George and Grandpa Pig. <laughs> What's that noise? <laughs> found you! Peppa has found George and Grandpa Pig in a bush. <laughs> it's so cosy in here. Yes. Reminds me of the garden den I had as a boy. Can we make a garden den, Grandpa? Yes, indeed. Hooray! <laughs> Everyone is wearing special gardening gloves and boots oh. to make the garden den. 
First, we need to dig a hole with these spades and get lots of sticks and twigs. Peppa loves digging the hole with Grandpa Pig. <laughs> oh. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Um, well done, Peppa. And George loves <laughs> gathering sticks. I think that's enough sticks. Well done, George. Now Grandpa Pig is hammering the sticks into the hole. Stand back, everyone. <coughs> Finally, Grandpa Pig makes a roof out of sticks. And Pepper and George cover the roof in lots of leaves. Why do we need the leaves, Grandpa? They keep the den nice and warm. Look safe and sound. <gasps> well done. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> You'll need this before we go in, Pepper. Grandpa Pig has given Pepper a special backpack. <laughs> Everyone is very happy with their new garden den. Um. Grandpa, what do we do in the garden den? My favourite thing to do in a den is have a <gasps> picnic. The special backpack is full of fruit from the garden. Pepper and George <laughs> love having a picnic in the garden den. Mm. Pepper, oh. George, where are you? <laughs> 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 Everyone loves having a picnic in the garden den. Peppa, have you decided what you're giving away to the charity shop? Yes, all of this. Whoa. <laughs> Today, Peppa is giving some of her toys and clothes to a charity shop. This is called donating. Huh? <laughs> Away we go! Whee! <laughs> Charity shops sell donated items Aww. and use the money to help people. Great! Do you want to help me sell them? <laughs> yes, please! I'll help by shopping. <laughs> Peppa is excited for people to buy her old things. <gasps> oh. But no one is buying them. No one is buying any of the things I donated, Miss Rabbit. Not to worry. We just need to let people know they're available to buy. <laughs> like this. Do you like <gasps> toy rabbits, Police Officer Panda? Yes. Did you want to buy this one? <gasps> I do. <gasps> Thank you. Why don't you try, Peppa? <laughs> <gasps> I'm a bit cold, <gasps> Mummy. Would you like to buy this jumper, Susie? It's very warm and woolly <laughs> and cosy. <laughs> yes, please. I love wool. Bonjour, Miss Rabbit. I'm looking for a gift for somebody <gasps> who loves sports. Hmm. <laughs> I know. Hmm. <gasps> <laughs> Catch! Ooh, ooh, this is perfect! <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Peppa wants to <laughs> sell her toy bus next, but there's no one left to sell to. There's no one left in the shop, Miss Rabbit, mm -hmm. except <gasps> Mummy. Let's put it in the window display so everyone outside can see it. Yay! Hello there. Look at this toy bus. Would you like to buy it? No one can hear Peppa from outside the shop. <gasps> the big real bus looks just like Peppa's little toy bus. <gasps> we have the same bus. <gasps> Maybe it'll sell tomorrow, Peppa. <gasps> Yay! Excuse me. 
Is that toy bus for sale? <gasps> Why, yes, it is. Would you like to buy it? I would <laughs> love to buy it. I love all buses, big and small. Hooray! Peppa loves the charity shop. Everyone <gasps> loves the charity shop. <laughs> Whoa! Today, Peppa and George have decided to dress up in Mummy and Daddy Pig's grown-up clothes. Gosh, what are these two <laughs> grown-ups doing in our bedroom? I'm not a grown-up. I'm Peppa and that is George. Well, you both look very lovely. But why are you wearing our clothes? We want to choose our own clothes today. Whoa! <laughs> Well, you do look very grown up. But I think our clothes might be a bit too big for you. Yes, these are a bit too big. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> these clothes fit much better. Peppa and George have decided to wear their own clothes instead. <laughs> now. You need to make sure you choose the right clothes for the weather. Today, it is very sunny and hot. Oh. <laughs> Do you think those are good clothes for a sunny day? Um, no. They're a bit too hot. And a bit too heavy. <laughs> Pepper and George have found some summery clothes to wear. That's much better. Now you also need to choose the right clothes for what you're going to do today. We're going to play group. But first we want to jump in muddy puddles. Puddles! Oh dear. <laughs> Pepper and George aren't wearing the right shoes for jumping in muddy puddles. Do you think you should wear boots instead? I think we should wear boots instead. Ho ho ho! Splendid idea! <laughs> Lovely! Are we ready to go? Almost! I just want to try on a few more things. Bonjour, children! Wow! What beautiful <laughs> outfits you have on Pepper and George! They picked them all by themselves. <laughs> I can see that. <laughs> and those boots. If you want to jump in muddy puddles, you must wear your boots, Madam mm. Gazelle. Of course! Oh. Oh. <laughs> Pepper and George love jumping in muddy puddles. I suppose it is lucky I brought my boots today as well. <laughs> Everyone loves them. Oh dear. There, there. Today, Peppa has found a video of when she was a baby. <laughs> I was a very loud baby, wasn't I, Daddy? Ho, ho. Yes, all babies are sometimes. Gosh. Oh. That must have been when I was pregnant with George. Pregnant? What does that mean? <laughs> that means he was still in my tummy. <laughs> oh, I have an idea. <laughs> what are you doing, Peppa? Look, now there's a baby in my tummy too. Oh, <laughs> very good, Peppa. Now, what do people with babies in their tummies do? Hmm, I used to get lots of funny cravings, which are when you really want to eat certain foods. Ooh, mm, mm, yum! Peppa has decided she has a craving too. I really want to eat... Oh! Spaghetti! <laughs> Peppa mm. thinks cravings are delicious. Mm. <laughs> ah, that was very yummy. <laughs> what else happens when you have a baby in your tummy, Mummy? Well, I'd get tired a lot, so kind people would offer me their seat so I could sit down when I needed it. 
Hmm. <coughs> Hello, Peppa. I have a baby on my tummy and I'm very tired. So you need to give me your chair, please, Daddy. <laughs> Gosh. right -o. here you go. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> and sometimes my feet would hurt. So Daddy Pig would give me foot rubs. <laughs> <gasps> Peppa likes the sound of foot rubs. Daddy, my feet are hurting. So I need to have a foot rub, please. Oh, well, not a moment to lose. <laughs> oh, 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 a little here and a little Daddy Pig's foot rubs are more Mr. like foot tickles. <laughs> oh. oh. There's one more thing that happened when Mummy Pig was pregnant. What was it? Eventually, Ooh. a baby came. Auntie Pig has brought baby Alexander for a visit. Hi, baby Alexander. I was pretending I had a baby oh. in my tummy. But now we can pretend that you're my baby. <gasps> <gasps> Real babies are quite noisy, actually. So I think I'll keep my cushion instead. Oh. <laughs> Peppa and her family are taking baby Alexander on the Ferris wheel. But he isn't very happy. What's that smell? Yeah. Hmm. It's baby Alexander. He needs a nappy change. But we're at the front of the queue for the Ferris wheel. Ooh. Hold your noses, everyone. Boo! This Ferris wheel smells terrible. Sorry, Peppa, but it's our job to look after baby Alexander. If we help now, we can play later. Yes. Baby Alexander needs our help. That's the spirit. Now let's go and look for a nappy changing station. Oh, that's better. Not here. <coughs> oh. <laughs> Not here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Definitely not here. <laughs> Ooh, here. Well done, Pepper. We found the nappy changing station. First, we have to take off the dirty nappy and put it in the bin. Um, where is the bin? Hmm. Ooh. Here it is, Daddy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> now, we must wash our hands. Add a dab of cream. Whoa! <laughs> Whoops! Sorry, Peppa. Now, finally, a clean nappy. Can I do this bit, Daddy? Of course, Peppa. There. All better. That was so fun. I've never changed a nappy before. You did very well, Peppa. But do you know what's even more fun than changing a nappy? The Ferris wheel! Phew! Wow! Oh, good day! What's this? What's this? Today is Arts and Crafts Day at Peppa's Playgroup. I have many fun <gasps> arts and crafts planned for today. First is painting. Ooh, but where are the brushes? They're right here. No one is sure what Madame Gazelle means. Where? <laughs> I don't see anything. 
We're doing finger painting. Instead of brushes, you paint with your hands. Hooray! Peppa and her playgroup are enjoying <laughs> making their finger paintings. A lovely flower, Peppa. Thank you, Madam Gazelle. What a wonderful butterfly, Susie. <laughs> Thank you, Madam Gazelle. <laughs> oh. And Danny, that's a marvellous puddle. Whoop. Thank you, Madam Gazelle. Whoop. Danny is jumping in his painting just like a real muddy puddle. Ah, brilliant idea, Danny. We'll do face <gasps> painting next. Everyone is getting their face painted. Susie is a butterfly. Danny is a zebra. Freddy and Emily are a tiger and a fish. And Peppa is green. I'm green. <laughs> <laughs> oh! That gives me a fantastic idea. Madame Gazelle has brought over a big ah. canvas with tape on it. What's that, Madame Gazelle? Why, it's a beautiful picture, of course. But I don't see a picture. That's because it's not finished. Each of you take a bottle of paint and splatter as much as you like onto this canvas. <laughs> well done, children. Get messy, have fun. Try not to spill on the floor. Everyone is having lots of fun painting on the big canvas. It's beautiful. I love it. Me too. Hmm. But I still don't see a picture. Aha! You will soon, Peppa. Madame Gazelle is taking the tape off the canvas. The tape has made the painting into the shape of... A star! A star! Peppa Hello! 